In the distant world of Warcraft, Thamador the Paladin adventures across the human kingdom of Stormwind, honourably fighting their enemies, the Orcs of the Horde. While hunting those responsible for murdering two farmers in Westfall, Thamador has discovered a mysterious figure plotting to attack the Stormwind army. Rallying disgruntled thieves, lowlives, and monstrous creatures into the Defias Brotherhood. Can't see a face, can't see anything. Oh, you're driving your motorbike up there. Now our story truly begins. There are revelations to be found in the dead mines. And Thamador will at last set foot in the capital of the Alliance. Stormwind City itself. So after last time, Thamador flew to the Lion Prides Inn for a good night's sleep. But we're picking up where we left off in Westfall and we're back in the town of Moonbrook, where there seems to be a revolution brewing amongst the disgruntled citizens. To find out why, we're going to chat to this guy. No offence, not sure what race you are yet. Warm wishes to you. Ooh, that voice. This incense will put your body and mind in a deep meditative state. Once the trance begins, you'll be pulled into the spirit, spirit world. What is this guy selling? Moonbrook's a rundown excuse for a town. A wretched hive of scum and villainy. And it has a secret underground tunnel upstairs in a house. Apparently here I can find clues to the identity of the mysterious revolutionary. Oh yeah mate, that rock is looking real comfy for a nap. Someone push a cart over him. Jesus, what are these things? This mine employs undead skeletons to do the manual labour. What do they call this? The Dead Mines, I'm guessing. Uh, right, this seems promising. A purple portal of some kind. Poor Thamador is getting a lot of new stuff thrown at him already today. Including a loading screen. So, okay, so what is this? A new area? Different instance? The Dead Mines. Light be with you. Like a raid area or battle zone. Okay, let's sniff this incense. Oh, oh, what's... That was quick. Five years ago in the heart of the dead mines. I'm now a vision of the past. This looks like some big ship that's docked here. Let's see what happened then. What's the big mystery? Ah. There's nowhere left to hide, Van Cleef. The defiers are through. We're here to finish this. Face us, coward. Is he going to come out? None may challenge the Brotherhood. Okay, he is, with some minions. Lapdogs, all of you. We have an epic battle, which I cannot influence at all. Fools. Our the Brotherhood righteous. prevail. He's trying to say a lot of things at once here. Oh, no, he's dead. The Defias Kingpin is dead. Victory for the Alliance, glory to Stormwind. Yes, excellent, good. So the bad guys were defeated then. Uh, yeah, jumping off a tall ship into a deep drop, I'm sure you'll be fine. Oh. What? Oh, it's a little girl. Vanessa Van Cleef, it's his daughter. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, daddy. She has to see her dad dead. Oh, and we're back in the dead mines. Our vision is over. Hey there. Well, I've got to head to the nearby Sentinel Hill and turn in this quest to Marshal Stoutmantle. I'm willing to bet that the shadowy figure who has been reviving the Defias Brotherhood is that little girl, Vanessa. So it's starting to make some sense. Oh, that's a cool view of Sentinel Hill. This place is still under construction, so it's frequently under attack by gnolls. Van Cleef had a daughter? Blimey, this guy's flabbergasted. How tragic. Poor thing witnessed a horrible act. Yes, I think that's why she's probably rebuilding her father's brotherhood. Revenge. Wait, on guard! What's happening? Something's going on. I don't like this, Thamador. Stay alert. Okay, no one coming from that direction. Are you sure you're not being a little bit paranoid? Oh. Oh, it's Hope, Hope Saldine. Last time she helped me feed Stu to the homeless and she was an orphan, so I think I can see where this is going. Hope, is that what I was supposed to feel when I saw my father decapitated by your henchman? He's just standing there, he's baffled. 
Hope is a cruel joke, played upon us by a harsh and uncaring world. There is no hope. There is only Vanessa. Vanessa Van Cleef. Got nothing to say still. Here she is, in full Defiance Brotherhood gear. Still pretty hot outfit. <coughs> Tie them up. That was, that was quick. They're very submissive there. I'm, I can still move around apparently. What's, what's she doing to the... Admiral, your hat... He, God, he just turned from a worgen into a human. Thank you, my dear. And you, Thamador, I will spare your life. You have done much to help our cause, orbit unwittingly. But next time we meet, it will be his enemies. Oh, so she thought she had to kill those farmers only because they knew her face. They knew who she really was. Leave nothing but ashes in your wake, brothers. Burn Sentinel Hill to the ground. We, they've only just rebuilt it. Thamador, get to Stormwind. Tell King Rin everything. Everything. Go now. Oh, my God. It's, it's, everything's on fire. What's going on? Look at this place. So does this place burn to the ground off this quest? I bet they get out of it before they change their mind. How are you? Uh, I'm doing okay. How are you doing considering your entire town's burning to the floor? I need a ride, fast! Well, this quest is now sending us where Thamador and I have wanted to reach from the very beginning. Stormwind City. Capital of humanity and a major hub for the Alliance. I mean, as much as I enjoy exploring forests and deserts in games like this, I love going into a city and discovering something new. Thamador is from the Stormwind area, but this is his first time stepping inside its walls as a paladin and adventurer. Best of all, we're visiting the king. I'm usually more of a sci-fi fan when it comes to aesthetics. You can't help but admire the art design here though. The city here is a big deal and it knows it. All right, here we are, Stormwind City. Cool. I'm going to be standing around looking at a lot of scenery. Please bear with me. Ooh, Voodoo the Horde Slayer. Dead nerves. Is that an enemy? Well, anyway, I came down here so I could enter Stormwind City through the gate. The army is here. Stormwind Infantry. I think there's some sort of Valentine's Day event happening at the moment, but look, we're in the Trade District. Is that a cheese shop? Really? Cheese? Okay, it's fine, I'm fine. I, I want to explore the culture. Don't really know where to start now, I'm actually here. A lot of activity going on though, a lot more than out in the forest, or actually anywhere else I've seen the game so far. So this is really what it means to be a massively multiplayer online role-playing game. At least everyone's in love, that's nice. All little back alleys. I hope I'm going in the right direction, I'm following my mini-map to try and reach the castle. That's so calm and picturesque. Hello. Peace be with you. Oh, thank you very much, Lyra Nightwind. What brings you here? Well, I'm here to see the king. I've got urgent business. Actually, really urgent business back in Westfall. Uh, Sentinel Hill's burning down. But, but don't you worry yourself about that. The old town with its cobbled street. Can I help you? No, I'm just looking around. Thank you. What's in here, then? Uh, heavy armour. I don't think I can wear that at the moment. Oi, Brun Golden Mug. What are you doing sleeping just outside the king's castle? I seem to be very royalist. I don't know if that's been instilled in Famidor from an early age. But then looking upon scenes like this. Wouldn't you also be a loyal servant of the king? All the blue carpet's been laid out. I'm so honoured, and in we go into Stormwind Keep. Ah, oh, there's such grandeur to this. Oh, what's going on here? The petitioner's chamber. There's a bishop and an emissary. Lots of titles in this place. King Rin. And there's that grand admiral I need to speak to in a minute, but I, I can't help but, I mean, do I bow? Can I bow? I'll just go up to him and say hello. Orduin Win. King of Stormwind. A king is only as noble as the causes he serves. Very wise, very wise, my 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 liege. Victory in the light. Yes, of course. I'm honoured, Your Highness, to meet you. Well, Grand Admiral, there's a bit of a situation going on in Westfall with the Defiance Brotherhood. I will deploy a battalion of soldiers to Westfall at once. Oh, I got a nice sword, a claymore, from House Rin. Very posh from their personal armoury. 
Okay, lots more to explore in Stormwind, but I need to fly back to Westfall pretty quickly and let the guys there know that help's on its way. Everything's still on fire. There's a haze, an mm. orange haze to the sky. I don't know if it's just nightfall. Well then, Marshall, we're back. Help's on its way. Need help? Five years of work burns to the ground in five minutes. Damn the fires. And this is only the beginning, Thabador. We have a long, hard road ahead of us. Ooh, I've got some achievements. But first of all, I've got somewhere else to go, so I'm not going to be fighting the fires yet. That's still to come. First, I've got to go to Lakeshire in Redridge. It appears I've done all that I can in Westfall, and that brings to a close this investigation. And a really cool storyline that's unfolded over these past couple of videos I've been doing of World of Warcraft. A new adventure begins for Thamador in the Redridge Mountains and beyond. More time to spend in Stormwind City, plus some teaming with friends coming up. So we'll leave it here for now, but I've got super into this game. I'm frequently on the wiki reading about its history. I'm going to subscribe, and so Thamador will be back. Now a powerful paladin and a hero of the Alliance. Thank you for joining us today, faithful viewers, and we'll soon return to the world of Warcraft.